Hi everybody, it's Kara, and I have a few more art journal pages I wanted to share with you guys. I got a couple more of them done um, this weekend. I think, if I remember right, the last time I did an art journal share with you guys, I showed you that I had several backgrounds kind of ready to go, but I hadn't finished some of the pages. So I actually went back and finished, I don't know, two or three of them, I think. But anyway, this is one of them. This is the one that I had created with um, layers of masking tape first. Hopefully you can kind of see. I did some, most of them down um, this way, but then I do have some places where I went across just to add a little bit of different dimension to it. And so what I did this weekend is I just went back and I used one of my stencils, which are this one right here, and then a new stamp set that I had. I gave the chicken wire effect and then this kind of, um, I'm not even sure what you'd call it, but it's just a really cool look. And I took one of my old um, older close to my heart letter sets and stamped art is my joy and then these little cork pieces are actually from cat scrappiness my last um, design team goodies and put together what I think is a kind of cool simple um, couple of pages so there's that one and then I did some collaging on this one I actually had the background already done with the tissue paper and the kind of reddish pinkish paint on there but I went through, I have a little like, um, kind of little bucket thing I keep on my desk with little odds and ends of scraps. And I went through that and most of that, what you see here is from that. Um, the bling is from that and um, most of the trim. I did go into my little stash of ephemera and pull out some of these little tickets. And I did take um, a little bit of cat scrape and its goodness and put it on here too. But basically I just kind of layered it around and used the scraps I had tried to find some kind of coordinating colors and then I put a few stamps on here it's kind of hard to tell um, with the light this morning there's also a piece of uh, oh netting that I mod podged back here but I have one stamp that says create creativity takes courage another one down here that says um, create every day and then this big one up here says strength doesn't come from what you can do it comes from overcoming the things you once thought you couldn't I did that. I had a lot of fun. I just basically didn't worry about it. I put whatever I wanted to down on the page. And, well, and then I also used some of my new pens and outlined. Hopefully you can see that blue. And then over here, the black. Some of those new pens that I got on my Seattle trip. And I had a lot of fun just kind of playing with those. And then I added a whole bunch of things to this one. This is just... Um, some cardstock that I stamped on and distressed up and then I just wrote down some of my favorite things and then once I adhered them I added a little bit of kind of coordinating washi tape and on some of them I put a little bit of the um, gelatos around the edges just kind of played around had a good time with that and then I think I have one more where I was playing with the pens and these are can you see how that looks on this paper these are completely dry this is the um, Secure Glaze pens, and if you guys have not tried them, they are cool. They do go on kind of wet, and they take a little bit of time to dry, but can you look at, can you see all that shine? I love that. They're very fun to play with. And that's all I was basically doing here was just some doodling. I had a lot of fun. I didn't, again, really think about it. I just messed around with the pens. So, anyway, that is my art journal share for this week and hopefully I will be back next week with some more. I have some other page ideas that I want to get going on and finish up. I'm um, actually, if you guys can notice, look I'm sticking with it. I'm really proud of myself. I haven't like, you know, decided to switch to another journal or give up or any of that stuff. So um, I think before too long I'm actually going to have a finished journal which really makes me happy. I'm glad I, I stuck with it and I'm having a lot of fun and I'm learning how a lot of things work. Um, my next art journal will probably be very, very different, but uh, this one has just been really relaxing and a stress reliever because when I, you know, open it up and do something, I basically am just playing. I don't think about it. I don't do a ton of planning. It's just a lot of fun. So thanks for watching, guys. And if you haven't given one of these a try, I hope you do. If you have any questions for me, leave them down below. And as always, I hope you're having a great day wherever you're at. Bye!